Good afternoon. This is your decision support briefing from the National Weather Service in Des Moines, Iowa, for the severe weather and heavy rain threat for later this week. Strong to severe thunderstorms will be possible both Wednesday and Thursday across Iowa. The main threat on Wednesday will be large hail and damaging winds, with isolated tornadoes possible especially during the afternoon. Thursday's severe weather threat will be located primarily south of I-80, with large hail and damaging winds possible. Additionally, several rounds of heavy rain are possible across the southern and eastern portion of the state this week, leading to chances of localized flash flooding. This is your severe weather outlook for Wednesday, June 28th, which features most of Iowa in the slight risks for severe weather, with northwestern Iowa in a marginal risk. Again, all modes of severe weather are possible, with large hail, damaging winds, and isolated tornadoes possible. There is a chance for very large hail to fall across most of Iowa during the afternoon. On Thursday, the severe weather risk will shift to the south, generally in the southern third of Iowa. Large hail and damaging winds will be the primary threat during the day, along with the chance of heavy rainfall. Speaking of heavy rainfall, several rounds of heavy rain and thunderstorms are possible from Wednesday into the start of the weekend. Widespread rainfall amounts of over one inch of rain are likely across the state, with several inches of rain possible across southern and eastern Iowa by Saturday morning. Again, to recap, strong to severe thunderstorms are possible Wednesday and Thursday. Several rounds of heavy rain are possible beginning Wednesday morning and persisting through Friday night, especially across the southern and eastern portion of Iowa. Stay up to date with additional outlooks and any severe thunderstorm or tornado watches issued by the Storm Prediction Center by viewing their website at spc.noaa.gov. For information on the forecast and any warnings issued, please visit the Des Moines National Weather Service website at weather.gov slash Des Moines. Further decision support information can be found in the local information menu by selecting decision support. You can also stay weather aware and find us on Facebook, Twitter, YouTube, the NOAA All Hazards Weather Radio, and through your favorite radio and TV station. Thank you for joining us for this decision support briefing for the active weather this week. Keep up to date with weather updates and stay safe.